luminous range is the range at which you can see a light with a given intensity and a given visibility for that day. The two, com the two components we use for luminous range are nominal range, which is given in the light list and in the luminous range problems, and visibility for that day. Let's take a look at this luminous range. Luminous range. Luminous range. So given a light's nominal range and the visibility for that day, we can figure out the light's approximate luminous range. Here's an example of one of the problems about luminous range. It says here, the light list shows that a navigational light has a nominal range of 12 miles and the visibility is 0.5 miles. What is the luminous range of the light? So I'm going to put a, I'm going to put a chart up here real quick, but I'm going to make an example on the board so you can see it bigger. The chart looks like this. Right, there's a blacked out portion and then it has visibility curves right so these are visibility curves and it has the luminous range and it has nominal range so the top and bottom are nominal range the two sides are luminous range and we have these visibility curves. Now let's solve the first problem that we just read. The light list shows that a navigational light has a nominal range of 12 miles and visibility of 0.5 miles. So we have a nominal range equal to 12 miles, a visibility equal to 0.5. Let's break out our graph and check this out. I'm going to move this in front of the camera for you. Alright, how's that? Here we are. This is our luminous range scale. It is a logarithmic scale which gives you luminous range based on a nominal range and a visibility for that day. So again, we said in the problem we had a nominal range of 12 and a visibility of 0.5 nautical miles. Here's our visibility curves. Here's our luminous ranges on both sides and our nominal ranges on the top and on the bottom. Now it's probably semi hard to read on this chart, but if you print the PDF that's supplied for you, this is the PDF here. So nominal range on the bottom, luminous range on the side, the visibility curves. And we said, given the nominal range and the visibility, we can calculate the luminous range. The nominal range that was given was 12 nautical miles. There's all these dashed lines down here. So we find 10, 11, 12, and you see you can connect that all the way to the top, 12. So you find 12 on the top, 12 on the bottom, connect those two, and see where they intersect the visibility curve of 0.5 nautical miles. Here, again, probably hard to read with a video, but if you get your PDF printed, we see half nautical mile visibility curve right here. And what we want to do is follow nominal range up until it hits the half nautical mile visibility curve, and then follow it directly over. And we come up pretty much halfway between one and two. Because this is a logarithmic scale, there's a tick mark right here, halfway. It's not quite halfway between 1 and 2 because this is logarithmic. So from 1 to 2 is this distance, but look at from 10 to 20 is a similar distance. It's just as you go up, the increments get smaller and smaller and smaller. Like 40 to 50 is tiny, right? But here we are from 1 to 2. And we went from 12 nautical miles. We followed it up until we hit the half nautical mile visibility curve, and then you take it straight over right so we're looking here so again 12 nautical miles 
follow it up until we hit the half nautical mile visibility curve and take it straight over and it comes a little bit below this 1.5 tick mark here so we guess about 1.4 and that let's make sure yeah 1.4 miles is the answer to this question so luminous range luminous range is the distance you can see a light with a certain intensity and a certain meteorological visibility and again here's a representation of that graph we just looked at and given a nominal range of 12 a visibility of 5 we find the nominal ranges right we draw a line between them we see where it hits that visibility curve and take it straight over and then we read the luminous range and this is our answer if you have any questions you know what to do post to the forum I'll answer them another student will answer them you can send an email and make some more video content send it to you this is luminous range there's about 10 of these questions it's not that hard and I think you shouldn't have much trouble figuring this out. So luminous range. What you need is nominal range and visibility. What nominal range is, it's basically luminous range with a visibility of 10. So they take all these ranges and say, okay, meteorological visibility of 10, that gives us a nominal range, an average range. When you look at the light list, is where you'll see all these nominal ranges. And then based on a nominal range, you change the visibility and it changes the luminous range. So that's what we're doing here. We're taking something that has a nominal range of 12 nautical miles and we are correcting for a visibility of 0.5 instead of 10. So we find nominal range, see where it intersects the visibility curve of half nautical mile, follow it straight over we get 1.4 nautical miles for the luminous range. Good.